Hey y'all, how's it going? Welcome to episode 12 of Enigmatica 2 Expert Mode. <clears throat> uh, this episode, we are going to look into advancing more into some machines. And I saved that heart to do on camera. We'll have some fish and chips here. Got some poutine food, and I did a couple more immersive engineering things. MG, MV energy and HV energy. <clears throat> Another wind generator, cool. And a factory block. How many? 64, cool. Boop. We'll set up. Oh, we got two wind generators. Neat. We'll set these up here. Our power generation is really low right now, but um, the first thing I'm actually going to do ouch, is, uh, by the way, I have two of these guys as friends. I got some eggs. Uh, hatch them. They don't follow me around, um, but that's okay. Whatever. <clears throat> they should protect the base pretty well. Anyway, one of the first things I'm going to do, and the reason I went down and got uh, these HV connections, is because... Yes, just like that, huh? Um, <clears throat> uh, the first thing we're going to do is connect our immersive engineering energy to our stuff over here. And the way I want to do that is uh, by making some kind of battery or energy cell. I found out that I was just kind of being kind of dumb, looked up some videos, and uh, I think I found out what I need to do. Uh, to make those work for me. And what am I looking for here? This. Um, because the reason this is going so slow isn't because of um, my piping or anything like that. It's that I'm just not generating a lot of energy. So, once we connect our water mills, that should fix that problem right up. Cool? Cool. You can also kind of see I've laid out space for two more up here. Uh, so, presuming that this will work. Uh, it's just getting the power up there. <clears throat> That's kind of a pain. Um, don't want the LV, I want the HV connectors. could just have this capacitor. Yeah. Cool. Good thought. Uh, bring this 
I need. here instead. Ow, ow, ow. Hitting the wires hurts. I also increased our backpack. And by increased I mean I made a bigger backpack. And I made a diamond backpack. They're really easy to make so I just did the thing. <clears throat> That might help me out here. A wooden post. And kapow. We'll see what this does. What we can do with this here. <clears throat> uh, then maybe put that back there. This. Right here. And now... It can. Okay. Now, will the cable reach? Ow! Boy, that packs a punch. Alright. Now we just need the cable to reach. Obstructed if it's on this side too, probably. We'll try it though. It is not obstructed there. Um, that brings up the question can I run a cable? No. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> so we do this. There's my other guy. He's going to kill something. And, uh... This boy can sit... Here? I don't know how far these, um... Cables can connect. It's not too far, but it's not tall enough. Owie. Those hurt a lot. <laughs> that looks better anyway. We can do the same thing on this side. And do the same thing on this side. Um. Hmm. I don't really like what the wooden post looks like there anyway. Uh, so we're gonna have some food. For a 
a second. I want to see what this is going to do. So, my glass cutter on me. Cool. Uh, gross. That's not what I wanted. Um, hmm. I know the wiring can go through water, because that's still fine. Uh, so maybe I just don't do that on this one. Uh, what I can do is just move this capacitor out. Then I connect this doodly bop to here. this doodly bop to here. Excellent. And this boy will go to the HV capacitor. Beautiful. And <clears throat> The way I would connect this, let's break that real quick. The way I would actually connect this is by doing something like this and run very, very dangerous wires across my entire thing. very much. Yeah, and that keeps it super duper full, but ow, ow, ow. Um, that looks super duper ugly. Uh, so what can we do instead? We can uh, break that. Break that. Grab some Signal them. Who's your buckets here? Where are they? Here they are. 8,000 RF per tick. Um, I want to make more posts. might just be fine. <clears throat> this will be back here. I'm just get that out of my way so I don't keep touching it. This is going to be ran That would be really nice Let's see Let's see Then 
awesome. Ow. Owie. Ow. That's very, very dangerous. Uh, how do I insulate these? How about that? Insulated... HV cable? No. Insulated... Oh, there's not insulated HV wire. That sucks. And, okay. So we just won't run around that side of our base, I guess. Because, <sighs> ouchie. Um, then, we plop this boy down. Eat some more pepperoni and heal. We put a connector here. Ah, uh, that's gonna be a problem with our reconstructor. Unless we turn it around. So we'll do that. Cool. towards me. Excellent. <clears throat> Do I have more food on me? None that I haven't eaten. Okay. So we've got this boy. Who's... Is that almost full? No. Okay. Not even. Sweet. Then we put down this boy. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> <clears throat> um, is that going to do anything? No. But that's okay. I'm just going to put down this boy right here and connect those. Uh, cannot. Can I attach? There. Cool. And then... Now, let me move this. We're gonna move our atomic reconstructor. This is gonna go here. Hopefully. Oh, boy. Excellent. And then... Boom. Is that... Is that gonna work? Let's see, I'm gonna cut power here and see if this keeps getting power. It is not. That's all right. <clears throat> what we will do then is what I planned on doing. Um, and that is making some kind of battery or energy cell. How much does it take to make this? Do I have mineral? I do not. I have mineral wood. <clears throat> Meaning I probably have a mineral sapling. I do. 
and uh, we have bone meal. So, let's get some mineral. I think that's the easiest battery we can make, so... figure out how to get the mineral, huh? Uh, right. Requires the enriched mineral wood. I could also get it out of a mechanical squeezer. Or this squeezer. Mineral resin? Have to, what do I use this for? Okay. I can do that. Uh, so, we'll just plant a couple more of these to get them growing. And put... this in here. What's it take to make some kind of tank? Uh, basic fluid tank. Oh, that's really easy. Okay. Cool. So we're just gonna have a tank over here. That's fine. And the squeezer is going to do its thing. Sweet. Uh, do we have a drying thing over here? We do not. Drying. Basin. What's this tick? Okay. Takes the things that we need. Ink sack. Kill a squid or so. some spawn. Hello, squiddy, squiddy, squiddy. Kapow. All right. <clears throat> Got some ink. Grab this clay real quick. Cool. Uh, I used all my clay. Making the immersive engineering connector things. So that doesn't look too super awful. Uh, we'll probably want to figure something better out though. Eventually. Uh, put the pipette up here. Drying rack, or drying basin, rather. Gotta just stick this over here. It's out of the way, but that's fine. Um, that's plenty of mineral. Don't need the LV stuff. I need at least two of those. Uh, 
Uh, let's just make some more of these drying basins. Yeah, here and. We're just going to dry all of this. All right. Almost there. So we need six of these each. That's enough for two. Four. We'll start there. Um, it's three. I'll drop those in there. So go in here <clears throat> and redstone inventory is full. Cool. All right. So that's good enough for now. Mineral berries can be used for. Nothing much. I'll toss them into the culinary generator. Boop. Alright. And these can actually be combined. Um, so. Cool. Stick that there. And now try connecting. Yes. That is also FE. But it shouldn't matter. Right? Uh, maybe it does. These use FE, but they're running off RF. No, these use FE. What? Why isn't that... Uh... Why isn't this pulling? Do not understand. Uh. Mm. Maybe it can't pull from the side? That would be really dumb. Uh, let's check that, though. No, well, that doesn't matter. Uh, can it only interact from the top? That would also be really dumb. That is not the case. Do I need to make a servo? 
No. It's not how energy works. <clears throat> what am I doing wrong? I'm clearly doing something wrong. This is all connected. Um, oh, maybe it's not connected. No, it's connected there. Break that. Um, let's pressurize something. Pressurize. I'll pressurize some iron. It's not getting any power. Why? Why? I could make this energy cell. Um, so I guess let's try try this one then. Okay. I don't understand. Uh -uh. Uh, let me try the leadstone real quick. See if for some reason it won't interact with the signalum. No, that doesn't matter. Okay. It shouldn't have, but... Alright, I'll be right back, and I'm gonna go through the extended process of making one of these. Alright, guys. I found one that worked. Um... The energy cell... takes some things that, uh are very difficult. Um, like we could make the device frame, I actually accept and finished one of the gate quests, or well, com accepted a reward for one of the gate ca quests we've completed already to get the Hanford engineering block. We could get a Nori easily, we have machine frames, but then these two things cost us issue. Um, this requires reinforced stone and advanced machine. The rubber is not a big deal. Reinforced stone, not a big deal. Clay dust is easy. But the advanced machine thing requires this carbon plate, which requires us to use the compressor, and I can't figure out how to power the compressor, for one. Um, probably me just kind of being a derp, but whatever. Um, advanced alloy, we could make that. Um, iron casing is just kind of a pain, so I was looking for other options and found the uh, energy cube. Um, that works fine. Uh, these aren't connected still, 
and it's it's getting power. So there's that. Boop. Now I'll reconnect it and see. Uh, that is still not doing, still not keeping up, but it is a heck of a lot better. <clears throat> And this is still gaining energy, so that's good. Uh, what I could probably do is um, connect another one. Uh, so I may do that thing. If I do that... But not there. Yeah. If I just do this for now. Oh. Um. Did that help at all? Is that actually is that actually worse? Might be. Ouch. Uh, so never mind on that. Uh, that's output. No, that should have been working fine. Should have been working fine. Huh. Uh, let's let's try that again. Just when I connect them, that it hurts so bad. I think. That should be draining. What if I break that? It's not draining. Oh, oh, oh. I'm dumb. Listen. They're all input, except for the one output. So then I reconnect those. And you are losing, but you're also... empowering this, which is pumped up with speed upgrades. So if I remove the speed upgrades, nice. And uh, everything should be 
going up? No. Sun is also setting. Um. Hmm. Maybe that's okay. I think that's okay for now. Just for now. Um, okay, so we have lots more power. And now that it's full sunlight, this is charging. Cool. So full sun, it charges. Uh, let's plop just one speed in here. Fairies. How's that doing? Just fine. Let's plop another speed in here. Cool. That's still gaining. Let's do another speed. Uh, still gaining. Nito Bandito. Um, another speed. That doesn't seem to be uh, hurting at all. Fast speed upgrades. Increased energy. Now it's going down. Uh, let's do five. Still going down by a lot. I don't understand. <laughs> so four. I don't know. Four is fine. Whatever will go in here. In here. Drop the rest here. Drop that there. Drop these things. Uh, crud. Inventory is full, yeah. Uh, let's take out all the slag and move it somewhere else for when I actually need it. Like over here in my random junk chest for now. Arrows go over here. Feathers. Vishroom can go also in here and cool all right so and that's that's just the power we're getting from one watermill well one watermill with three wheels but once we set up our other two that should be a decent bit of energy. Um, right? Right. Um, 
I think I will probably do that off screen though. I don't think there's a reason to do it on screen. We've already built one. Um, maybe though. Um, what do we, what now? What, what next? Uh, let's see if there's any new foods we can make. I don't think there are. The carrot cake just doesn't count as being eaten because I can't eat it out of my hand. Doesn't look like there is. <clears throat> there is not. Okay. That's fine. We've got some decent food up there anyway. Um, what do we want to get into? We don't really care about this. Oh, interesting. Interesting. How do I make ice? Glacial precipitator. A uh, snow block in a mana pool with an alchemy catalyst. <laughs> a hydrator. Hydrators usually aren't too hard to make. Or a compressor. I don't know how to power the compressor. Uh, yeah, that's not, that's not hard to make at all. We can make the hy hydrator. Ha ba 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 ba. Um, what else can you make? Neat. Oh, I can make my selling out of there. That's cool. How do I make this? Okay. Neat. Neat, neat. And I can make white concrete. Tacked ice, ice. Concrete, concrete, concrete. Uh, wool. I can use the hydrator to decolorize wool. That's cool. Black glaze terracotta. Okay. I can decolorize terracotta. Make lily pads. Maybe we'll we'll look into that as well. Um, for now, though, I'm gonna wrap up. We didn't do much, just derping around with um, setting up power we already had. But um, it's set up now, and that's good enough for now. Um, 
what I want to do next time is look at that um, generator we were just looking at. I think that'll be cool. Um, seems like pretty easy free power. Uh, you can use up to three hot and three cold. One, two, three, one, two, three. Um, okay. And then you output the energy through the top. Um, check the engineer's manual, see which blocks are val valid. Obviously lava and ice, which is what we'll use initially. Um, so we might look into that and, uh, geothermal, oh, produces a U from lava. Here's how we produce EU. This is the stuff we need to make to produce junk. Okay. Well, that's fine. We found an easier solution. Anyway, that's it for me. Um, I don't think we'll do much with industrial craft for a while. Um, I feel like I'm not a huge fan of it. That may change as we progress. Like, a jetpack is right over here. Uh, so we might look into that. It might be a quick and decently easy flight. I don't know if we really need to fly right now, though. Uh, what else could we do? We could get into some magic stuff. Um, I'll think about it in between episodes and try to figure out what, what we want to do. Could do a farmer there. There's no real reason for a farmer right now, though. Uh, let's collect this stuff that we did last time. I'm just gonna leave that unclaimed. Um, what other things have we done? Grab this red velvet cake. Oh, did I get both? I did. And... Yeah, that's it. Uh, we could also do the biofuel biogenerator route. For more power. I don't know. Uh, but Tanya's still... Gated. Let's look at the other gates. What sounds fun? Could ungate Batania and do some X Nihilo. That'll be interesting. Um, that would open up. Psy, which I've never done anything with. Blood magic. I'd actually need to get into thermal expansion first. Which requires RF tools, which requires industrial foregoing. Which requires... Machine case. Which gets me a latex processing unit. But... We need the advanced machine casing. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Uh, so it, it sounds like before we progress more in, in these gated things, we need to, um, we need to actually get some EU production going. Yeah. What? What? What in the world? Okay, uh, well, let's open these and wrap up.
Copper block, hay bale, and a brewing stand. Cool. What are these? They're in base Minecraft. Ender bookshelf. Neat. End exchanger. And cluster. Um. <clears throat> oh, okay. Oh, cool. We have that thing. And hay bales. And uh, brewing stand. Boop. Cool. Uh, so uh, we've we've got some stuff going for us. We'll figure out what we want to do with everything when we come back next time. Uh, that's it for me, guys. Thanks for staring at the sun.